I'm Keenum. Today we're going to learn about division. We've got two people here, and what do you know it? Ten blocks. Ten blocks. Yep, and I want to make sure that each person gets the same amount of blocks. All right, so let's start splitting up the ten blocks. What do you say? All right. You can have two and you can have three, but three and two are not equal. So we gotta keep sharing. Okay, here we go. You get two more and let's give you two more. Uh-oh, that's five and that's four. So we need to make sure that the extra one gets split amongst both of them. Okay, so. Now we have four and one, that's five. Four and one, that's five. So 10 divided by two is equal to five. 10 divided by two is equal to five. Well, what if we just had eight blocks? Hey, look at that. Eight blocks. Uh-oh, come back. <laughs> eight blocks. Woo, we got eight blocks right here. And if we give each of these guys four, eight divided by two, or eight blocks shared amongst two people is equal to four. Each person gets four blocks. Okay. We're not done. We can keep going. Let's try six. If we have six blocks, six blocks, then we can share them among two people by giving each person three blocks. Six divided by two equals three. And let's take it another step further. If we have four blocks and we want to share it amongst two people, four divided by two, Okay, let's see if that's correct. One and three. No, 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 no. That doesn't make any sense. We want them to be equal. So let's try this. Two, which is equal to two. Yep, four divided by two is equal to two. When we have four blocks and we want to share it among two people, then we get four divided by two, which is equal to two. <laughs> Okay, now we have 21 blocks. 21 blocks and we want to share them among three people. So let's let's start sharing blocks and see where that takes us. Let's give this guy two and let's give this guy one. Move the extras over here. Uh, three is not the same as two and that's not the same as one. So we, we gotta keep sharing here. Let's give this guy two, three, two, three. Okay, they're not the same. And look at all these extras we still have to share. We still have to get rid of or rather distribute the remaining blocks. So let's see here. Maybe we can give this guy, he's got five. That's not the same as three or three. And we still got leftover. So how about we give the other Lego people more blocks? There we go. Now they are equal five, five, and five, but we still have six left over. So let's see. Let's give you an extra one. Give you an extra one and let's give you an extra one too. Hmm, okay. Getting closer, we got three left over. Okay, I think, oh no! Okay, we can fix it. Whew, that was a close call. All right. We're sharing, we're distributing all of the blocks so that everybody gets the same number of blocks. That's how we are dividing here. Okay, so it looks like five and two, five plus two, that's five, six, seven. Five plus two equals seven. Five and two, 
five, six, seven. Okay, so five plus two is seven. And this feller has seven blocks too. So seven is equal to seven, which is equal to seven. So 21 blocks divided among three people is seven. 21 divided by three equals seven. How do we share 12 blocks among three people? Hmm. Each of these people need to get the same number of blocks. Okay, so 12 divided by three. Here we go. Start by giving some blocks away. Three, two, two, those are not equal, so let's make these equal. Okay, three is equal to three, which is equal to three, but we still have left over, so let's distribute the remaining three like so there we go 12 blocks divided among three people is equal to four blocks each person gets four blocks 12 divided by three is equal to four Okay, we have over here 20 blocks and we have five people. Well, technically four people and one robot. Beep boop, beep boop. We'll count him as an honorary member of the team. Now, we wanna divide the 20 blocks in such a way that we can share these 20 with the five team members here. Hmm, so everybody has to get the same number of blocks. Let's start with two. Let's make sure everybody gets two and see if that does the trick. Two is equal to two, which is equal to two, which is equal to two, two, two. But we still have leftovers. Oh, okay, we gotta keep sharing. So let, let's try sharing more blocks. Let's give this feller four total. Same for this person holding the camera. Looks like the robot could use a few more. Four, which is four, which is four, but that's not equal to two. And we still have more, so we gotta keep sharing. Okay, let's distribute more of these blocks. Oh, there we go. Four is equal to four, which is equal to four, which is equal to four, which is equal to four. So that tells us now that we have actually successfully shared 20 blocks among five people. So 20 divided by five is equal to four, four blocks. Here we have one ball, one, and we have two people who want it. You can't divide one ball evenly among two people, so only one person can win. Here we go. Tie game, no one wins. Hey, I've had a lot of fun doing some division problems with you today. Things like six divided by three equals two. We'll do more of these on this channel. Early childhood math, but no snooze fests allowed. If you need additional resources, that's your ticket right there. That website. See you on next week's video. God bless. 20 blocks, four people. Does the same strategy work from before? Let's give everybody four and see if that does it. Four, four, and four, that makes 16, but we still have, we still have four left over. So we need to share the four among 
these four people. Okay, well, let's uh, divvy it up. Here we go. Let's give you an extra block. Let's give you an extra block. And let's give you an extra block. And you get an extra block, too. Hey, 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 look at this. Five is equal to five, which is equal to five, which is equal to five. So every Lego person gets five blocks. Five blocks. So... 20 blocks divided amongst four people is equal to five. Two people trying to get one ball. You can't divide the one ball among two people, so only one person gets the ball. Now, if you had a big old butter knife, or maybe any kind of knife, maybe you could cut the ball into two pieces, two halves. But as of now, the only option is for one person to win the race. Or, if you have two balls and three people racing to get it, the only options you have are for two people to win. I would call that a tie. See about dividing 20 blocks among two people. 20 divided by two. What does that equal to? Oh, here we go. Here we go. This is easy. Look at that. Okay. Yeah. Five and five make 10. Five and five make 10. So when we divide 20 blocks among two people, each person gets 10 blocks. 20 divided by two is equal to 10. Yeah.